first, we're on top of breaking news in Times Square, where police say a tourist was shot by one of three suspected shoplifters inside a store on 42nd Street. Good evening. I'm Natasha Verma. And I'm Steve Lacey. All this is going down apparently just after 7 o'clock tonight. Police telling us two officers were also shot at. Let's get the latest from Fox 5's Jessica Formoso, who is live in Times Square tonight. Jess. Steve and Natasha, this is still a very active scene. Police still here questioning employees of the store where the shooting takes place. And I have to tell you, this is not just where the shooting happened. This stretches, the scene stretches for blocks. And that's because there were multiple shots, shot, uh, multiple shots um, over on 48th and 6th Avenue. Now, this all went down, started inside JD Sports here on 42nd and Broadway. Uh, according to police, just after 7, 7 o'clock p.m., three young men were inside the store shoplifting as they were making the way out to the loss prevention officer was at the door waiting for the young men. One of the three young men immediately leaves. Two are left behind. The loss prevention officer asked to see the bag and receipts. She takes the bag away from one of the suspects. That's when that same suspect takes two steps back. She's watching him and notices that he reaches for a gun. Police say he pulls out a gun, shoots at the loss prevention officer. She ducks and the bullet hits a tourist who was inside shopping. She was shot in the leg. Immediately, the shooter flees on foot, heading north on 6th Avenue. NYPD officers chase the suspect, and authorities say on 48th and 6th Avenue, the suspect shoots two rounds at the cops. Police officers never shot back. A person is has been apprehended and taken into custody. The person in custody is not the shooter. You're about to hear from a vendor who was across the street when this all happened. Yeah, I'm a little bit shocked and we would like to go back uh, to the hotel first day in New York. Now, the victim was taken to Bellevue Hospital. She is expected to survive. Police um, have given a description of the shooter. They say he's a, a young man wearing a white baseball cap, a white jacket, and white pants. They are giving a $10,000 reward. Now, another thing that police are telling us tonight is that the loss prevention officer did speak to the suspects in English, but they did not understand her. That's the latest we have from Times Square tonight. I'm Jessica Formoso. Fox 5 News. Natasha, Steve, back to both of you inside. All right, Jess, thank you.